Good afternoon, I'm Cindy Fry, President of the Columbus Area Chamber of Commerce. The threat of COVID-19 calls us all to take aggressive action to protect the public's health. And as Dr. Nabalski said, make sure that the health system is not overwhelmed. We understand those important necessary actions to protect the public health have had a negative effect on the health of many businesses. The federal government has just recently streamlined and announced new programs that should help ease the pain. Through the CARES Act, they've developed the Payroll Paycheck Protection Program, and they've streamlined the Economic Injury Disaster Loan. Both programs are designed to get needed cash into the hands of employers so they can keep employees working. And both programs have less paperwork, a quick turnaround time, and fewer strings attached. And you may be eligible if your business employs fewer than 500 employees, is a 501c3 nonprofit. If you are an individual sole, sole proprietor, an independent contractor, or a self-employed individual in a trade or business. Now the Pay Check Protection Program is the one getting a lot of attention because up to 100% of the loan may be forgivable in, in many circumstances. And the portion that is not forgivable carries a very low interest rate of 0.5%. The maximum loan will be the equivalent of two and a half times monthly payroll uh, compared to the prior year. There are a lot of details to this program. In fact, the CARES Act is 900 pages long, so um, CPAs and attorneys and bankers are still trying to sort out all of the details and the implications. But the Paycheck Protection Program is only available through a financial institution. And the portal for those applica applications is to open on April 3rd. So if that program is applicable to you and is something you'd like to pursue, you need to contact the lender with whom you have a relationship. Uh, if you already have a, a, an account with one of the local institutions, that's where you need to go to apply for these funds. Now to apply for the Economic Injury Disaster Loan Program, for loans of 25,000 or less, you can apply for those online at sba.gov. It is a very simple online form, and we're hearing that it takes 15 to 20 minutes to apply. Now this is a more traditional loan. However, it comes uh, with a cash advance of $10,000. Both programs, require no fees, no collateral, and no personal guarantees. It's really quite remarkable that um, the government programs have been able to strip away some of the things that make, make these funds difficult to obtain in normal times. The Chamber and the Indiana Small Business Development Center have been working together to get the necessary information to our business community. And we've been offering daily webinars, and you can find out about those webinars on the Chamber's website, which is columbusareachamber.com. Those are just two programs that are available to help ease the pain that businesses are feeling, but there are other concessions as well with regard to payroll taxes. Um, these are detailed in the CARES Act, and we'll be offering additional workshops via webinar uh, in the coming weeks, we're talking with certified public accountants, attorneys, and others who can help us uh, tease out what the details of these programs are and help them um, help find ways to help you be more successful during these difficult times. Again, that website is columbusareachamber.com. The Chamber's here to serve you in the next few months and always. Thank you.